Impressive, is it not? Fit for a leader, meant to show influence and the burden of it. It is where the Inquisition will sit in judgment, where you will sit in judgment. Will we be taking heads right here in the hall? Goodness, no! If such an option is available, it will be done elsewhere. And it may not be necessary. The Inquisition Justice has many tools. If their application is... Is there anyone I should... Take the throne when you're ready. We will bring... You sent for me, Inquisitor. Knight Templar Delrin Barris, we've gathered to review your military service to the Inquisition. You showed exceptional valor defending the people of Valkaleen from Venatori, and broke a siege of demons in Ansberg. You stood against an entire town that wanted to kill a mage for imagined demonic possession, without raising a sword. In thanks for your service and your help at Therenfall Redoubt, I endorse your promotion to Knight Commander of the Templar Order. Your Worship, I... I am not worthy. Your service has restored more faith in the Templars than speeches ever could. I pray to Andraste to serve many years more. Templars, will you take Sabaris as your Knight Commander? Knight Captain Denham, Inquisitor. He awaits judgment for serving the Lord's Seeker at Therenfall Redoubt. I knew some of the knights who died there. I asked to oversee his sentencing. Denham knew the dangers of Red Lyrium. He murdered the Knight Vigilant and corrupted his brothers and sisters. We'll find a suitable punishment for the good captain. I only did as I was told. We found everything. The corpse of the Night Vigilant, even papers proving you knew Red Lyrium was poison. There is a greater power walking this world. I wasn't fool enough to deny it. None of you would have. I demand justice. Then have it. Take him to the gallows. You can't! Not after I survived this long. Don't you see?
Hey, you. You have time? It's not a question. Let's go. I've got something I want to do for you. Just come. You won't need your gear and stuff. <laughs> With you, I'll do anything. I bet, yeah. Come on, let's do it. We're eating on a roof. They're horrible, right? And raisins, ugh. I freaking still hate cookies. No, no, it's just that this is all a little confusing. I got caught stealing when I was little, yeah? You get alienage or worse for that, but the Lady Emerald took me in. She was sick and couldn't have children. I had no parents. It worked out. Anyway, she gets a year sicker, so I ask her about cookies. Because mums make cookies. I can pass that down or something. Turns out, she couldn't cook. She missed that talk with her mum. The one she made, she bought and pretended. Ah, oh, right. Well, no, she was a bitch. She hid buying them by keeping me away from the baker. She did that by lying that he didn't like me, didn't like elves. She let me hate so she could protect her pride. I hated him so much and I hated... Well, she died and I hate pride. Pride cookies. But this is great, you're great. So I thought maybe me and you could make some, I don't know, us cookies. Because then I could like them again. Oh, it's stupid. daft every step to me. Ah, oh, piss balls. I could have made a whole dirty thing about your biscuit. Or muffins. <laughs> muffins on the... on the roof? Because tits? This is silly, wonderful fun, just like you. That's good, right? Because the roof was a really bad idea. Can't do it on a roof. My roof, my rules. Oh, I am gonna break both. <laughs> So I drew Criffy wants its face on it and stuffed it with apples. Everyone's hitting it with sticks. I really hope you like it. <laughs> We're giving gifts now. <laughs> 